Okay, looks like the sales team is about to visit our top customers at the end of the month. Our BI reports can show historical sales performance, but not the expected performance. Good job, we've got every angle. So, I'm going to first need to identify all of our A-list customers. This we can do if I have access to our customer rating classification. Then I need to select all of the open orders for these customers that are due before the sales team visits the customers at the end of the month. I'll break this down to a daily list of due orders. I then need to determine the expected delivery reliability of these open orders and highlight any orders that are likely to be delivered late. Just reporting on issues is not enough. I also need to understand the root cause of the issue, so I need to work out the reason for that potential delay. Using every angle, I could also go that extra mile and highlight any of these orders that have insufficient stock and are dependent on the prompt delivery of open purchase orders. Let's create a new angle through the activity diagram. There's already a template angle on the sales orders I can use. Quickly add a name. Now I'd like to add a filter on customer rating. And another one on due date. Because I only need the answer for this month, I'll limit the period to 31 days. That gives me 31 sales document schedule lines. Let's take a look at the individual schedule lines for more details. The delivery reliability column indicates all orders that are critical or not critical. Every angle suspects a problem in the near future on all orders that are marked as critical. So let's make a chart out of this column. Now I want to see what the bottleneck for these orders is. That's interesting. From all critical orders, most issues arise due to a problem in planning. Before I continue, I'm adding this one to a dashboard. Let's drill down on these six issues. I want to go one step further and find out which type of orders are delivering to those critical sales documents. I can do that by adding a jump, which will go one step upwards in the flow of the supply chain, straight to the delivering orders, in this case, purchase orders. Brilliant. That provides a great overview of our performance to our priority customers. A list of any customer orders likely to experience issues. And a detailed list of purchase orders that need to arrive to ensure that orders arrive on time. This will allow us to take action to ensure that our sales and account management teams are not going to walk into any difficult situations at the 